Hello and welcome to another video with me, Elmo J. Cardellan. You can call me this guy. It's good to have you along. Today I'm going to be discussing which guitar you should get. Should you get an acoustic or an electric? Which one is better? Well, we'll find out after this intro. <laughs> Okay, so should you get an acoustic or an electric guitar? This uh, is actually a very important question when you're starting out and even though it's been discussed uh, to some degree uh, on YouTube by others, uh, I thought I'd weigh in and I've even discussed it in one of my videos about uh, the myths of guitar playing, but I thought I'd revisit it because I think it is a very important question when you're starting out. and. I also happen to have some personal uh, experience with the issue. So, which should you get? Well, the answer is actually very simple. It depends on what you want to play. Um, and I can't emphasize that enough. It's really important that you get the appropriate guitar for what you want to play. So, um, if you want to play heavy metal, don't get an acoustic. If you want to play, let's say, fingerstyle flamenco or some Andres Segovia or something like that, uh, don't get an electric, get an acoustic. Um, you have different types of guitars, of course. You have nylon string guitars or steel string guitar, uh, like this, uh, and you have different types of electric guitars as well. Now, first off, cost does come into it, so an acoustic you can get a bit cheaper than an electric because you also need an amp and that will generally cost you a bit more, although you can find uh, quite good deals out there. Well, here's the thing. Uh, an acquaintance of mine, uh, her son was going to start to play guitar and she asked me, uh, because he wanted an electric guitar, and she just asked me, can't I just get him an acoustic one? Uh, and I said, well, no, uh, because that'll just kill his inspiration uh, straight away. Uh, and she kind of uh, thought along the lines of uh, what if the added investment of an acoustic, uh, sorry, an electric and uh, an amplifier would just be money wasted if he just quits playing anyway after a year or so. So she opted in the end to get him an acoustic and he quit playing. He never really got going. Uh, and you never know, of course, when you start playing, you never know if you're going to continue playing. But the odds that you will continue playing are much greater if you buy the right instrument for what you're trying to do. So if you have an acoustic and you want to play ACDC, maybe not the best thing. Um, yeah, so there is that. So if you want to play something like this, maybe acoustic is the way to go. Whereas, if you want to play this... If you want to do that, then maybe electric, or not even maybe, Definitely electric is the way to go um, because it's just way more fun when you're doing it on the right instrument for the appropriate kind of music. And let's face it, uh, someone to play acoustic stuff 
someone to play electric stuff. Now, what's my kind of uh, personal experience with this? Well, uh, when I started playing, um, my parents decided that they would buy me a guitar to see if I would get interested. And my grandparents were really kind of in on the idea and they said, yeah, we'll buy him a good acoustic guitar. And my dad, who's a drummer, uh, he said, absolutely not. I know my son and he's just gonna quit. He, he's not even gonna start. And luckily my parents bought me an electric guitar. It still took a while for me to really get going, but it was just way more fun. I, basically, I just did this in the beginning. <laughs> that kind of stuff. Um, but that was impossible on an acoustic guitar. And so I ended up with an electric and I was happy with that. And eventually I even started to learn something and actually learn how to play, which would probably never have happened on an acoustic. It's the same thing that happened with me when uh, my parents thought it would be a great idea if I, want, if I started to play piano. Uh, I wasn't into that at all. I played for a year, learned basically nothing and was very happy when it's all ended because piano back then wasn't my thing I just wanted to do the kind of the heavy stuff and uh, play fast <laughs> and all that um, so really um, if you're considering buying a guitar get the appropriate one if um, you have parents who are considering getting you a guitar uh, talk to them about this and say that you try to make these same arguments so that you say it's uh, better if the instrument is appropriate to the music. If you're a parent who's thinking of buying a guitar for your child, think about what kind of music uh, he or she listens to and likes and try to get the guitar uh, that's appropriate for that music. Other than that, there are of course differences between the instruments. Uh, the electric guitar is slightly easier to fret, so it is a bit easier in the beginning, but it's not huge. The, the main thing is really interest. So if heavy metal interests you or your son or daughter, then it's an electric guitar that should be the instrument of choice. Uh, and likewise, if it's classical, then get a nylon string guitar. Uh, if it's uh, finger picking a la Toma, Toma, Tommy Emmanuel, then get a steel string acoustic. Yeah, so that's basically it. Get the instrument that's suitable for the music because uh, interest in the beginning is key. Otherwise, nothing will happen and the investment will surely be a failure. So that's basically all I have for you today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it was of some use to you. Uh, give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and a thumbs down if you didn't like it. And um, comment, let me know uh, if you're a guitar player who's played and you have uh, an experience with this kind of stuff or if you have friends or whatever, uh, comment, let me know. And because, yeah, Sometimes it can even work out, even with the wrong instrument, so to say, that the interest or passion is such that you uh, practice heavy metal on an acoustic guitar because there is nothing else. Um, subscribe if you haven't already hit that bell notification thing and support me on Patreon because it helps me make more of these videos. I hope you enjoyed the video. It was good having you along. Take care. Goodbye.